Hello there and welcome to Hair by Ari. We got a new intro, we're out here now. Anyways, today's episode, how to work with your curls. He's got curly hair. We're gonna be working with him, not against him. We're just gonna go with the flow today. Just let it do its thing. I'm gonna teach you some tricks on how to just let it just be its natural self in its natural state. That's, does, that sound, does that sound good to you? It's super cool. It's super cool, right? David Ari. Yeah. It's super cool. Yes. I'm excited. Are you excited? I've, I'm excited. Yeah. First thing we're gonna do though is chop off these curls, cause no one wants no one wants side curls. You want the top curls. Maybe we should dedicate yeah. this to Prince. Yeah. Oh. He had like the top curls going on, right? That's right. This episode's dedicated to Prince. No. Let's go. So we're working with the curls. We don't need to overcomplicate or overthink it. It's really simple. We need to let the products do the work for us. It's a very important part of hairstyling. Letting the products do the work for you. Letting the product do the work for you. It would be very difficult for me to do my job without products. So what we're gonna be using first is the primer. Taste it. Curl. There's Taste 100 it. curl products out there. I've used a lot of them. Um, but this one is definitely my favorite so far. So you just want to start with the primer. I like to shower my clients with it because it smells so nice. It smells good, right? And then you, the way to work curls is you want to finesse it like so. Just give it a little, you know, make it, make it your friend. Just give it a little finessing. Then we're going to be going in with the defining cream. It's not too heavy, so it's going to, you know, give it some lift. And we just need a little bit, guys, not too much. Rub it in here. Your fingertips there, just a little bit. Smell it. Mm -hmm. smells, smells good. You know, it smells kind of girly, but he's a girly guy, so he doesn't care, right? Right, right. Yeah, I want to be yeah. like Prince today. Yeah, we're, this is a Prince episode, so he can be girly. Yeah. That's us, you're totally right. <laughs> yes. So we're just gonna work into the hair, yes. You know what, since this is Prince day, we're gonna be using a little mousse as well. <laughs> I'm sure Prince used some mousse in this. <laughs> So we're just gonna, just broke it, that's all right. <laughs> it's even better. Prince definitely used mousse. So we're using a little mousse, guys. <laughs> just to give it that extra bump. And these are all curl products. So it's gonna help us work with his curls. Working with the curls. Just fluffing it up, okay. And then another very important tool in the curl arsenal is the diffuser. Very important tool. And how you use the diffuser is you don't want to be doing this all the time. You just want to, you don't want it too high either. If it's too high, you're going to frizz out the hair. So just a high heat, low speed, and then you just want to hold that there. Just be very patient. Get ready. Okay, you guys, so now that it's dry, we've, you know, this is where the curls are naturally going to live. So this is when we just start, you know, just shaping it. And this is where you need to be a little artistic. Shaving it? No, shaping it. Oh, you know, shaping it. Like a sculpture, like a curly man sculpture. All right. Weird. <laughs> I'll be brave. Shape it, shape it. So if you want some scissor over comb techniques, just watch my scissor over comb video. I'll, I'll leave the link below. Um, but you just want to go in, you know, and you always want to use your mirrors. Your mirrors are your mirrors aren't there for your clients to look at themselves. They are a tool for you <laughs> to look at your angles, look what's working, what's not working. I didn't know that. Yeah, that's crazy, they're right? For me. Yeah, they're not for you. Is this camera for it's me? It's a tool for me. Okay. Okay. If you're a hairstylist out there, have you ever, when you get done with a haircut and they go to pay and then you see something that that you know you didn't see when you were next to them that's because you're not utilizing your mirrors you know what i mean and you, you, you every hairstylist knows that feeling when you're like oh gosh darn it i missed a spot that's because you're not utilizing your tools 
Do you give them their money back and then say like, hold on to this until I'm done with you? I don't. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I'll make them. I'll be like, hey, let's just come over here for a second. Let's come back to my seat for a second. You've done that with me. But cool. you know, I'm in a career. At, I'm in a, like the time of my career right now where I know how to use my tools, my mirrors. Oh. So, the longer you do hair, the more you'll, you know, the more you get comfortable with what you're doing, and you're gonna. The biggest thing to remember is you're gonna learn from your mistakes. That's a huge one. Just be happy when you make mistakes. Nice. Be stoked when you make a mistake, and just remember like what, why you made that mistake, and if you and do research on how to fix it if you don't know. Maybe get a bleed mark or something, but that's, uh, that's every time I make a mistake now, it still sucks. But I'm really excited because I'm like, oh my gosh, I know how to not do that next time. <laughs> <laughs> that's good wisdom. It really is the only way to learn. So yeah, now we're just gonna we're just gonna go through the hair and just shape it, make it all cool and curly. So enjoy this little. We'll see you at the end. Working with the curls. Oh, yeah. They're your friends. Don't be scared of those curls, guys. Just let them, let them do their thing. You know, let's let's show the people. Look at that, you guys. See? You know, we got rid of the curls on the side, but on the top, we're just working with them, making them look nice. You look good, right? Feel good? I, you did it. He's ready. He's ready to go do stuff out there and look nice and feel Let's good. Woo! Wow. Anyways, Whoa. you guys, thank you for watching. Have a good rest of your day. Peace.